Hey fans, Rikudo Sanin here. Uh, yeah, I just looked outside and uh, the sun's coming up. It is a beautiful morning. Oh, uh, looking again, that's actually just one of the many street lights on our street. So, uh, sorry about that. <laughs> um, sorry, I'm just changing my music real quick. Uh, my bad. Um, I realize how stupid that made me look. But that's fine. Uh, so, uh, yeah. Um, I went off screen and it took some time to get to Pokemon. Um, one is actually one you have to gamble for, and that took an obscenely long time. Uh, I actually had to um, gamble for it. Uh, and it's Porygon. And the other one, it was a. Uh, uh, pincer, which I caught in Safari Zone. So, uh, yeah. Our, it was a really, really long process. Um, but that's okay. I mean, it's worth it, right? Okay, another horsey. Uh, by the time we finish all this, we should be able to go back and get our, um, our dome fossil, which should become a Kubto. Uh, I don't know how long that really takes, so, uh, I just will assume after all this it'll be done. Uh, no, didn't kill him. Oh, and it's not confused either, crap. Ah, oh, and it's killing me, it's what's worse. You know, I remember when I was playing this game for the first time, Pokemon Blue, uh, I had level 35 Onyx by this time, I don't even know why. It was just, it wasn't even that good, it was just terrible. Um, yeah, I wasted a lot of time, and I did a lot of crazy stuff off screen. Nah, I'm just kidding, I didn't. Uh, whatever. <laughs> okay, I just don't want to fight this tentacle. Um, yeah, this area is super, super vast, so you really have to look for what you're gonna, who you're gonna fight next. Down these walls for me. Ah, uh, this has to be one of my favorite songs ever written. Uh, it's called "These Walls" by Dream Theater. Got a moment? Check it out. Just like I said to every other song. Also, um, you should check out some of my favorite videos. I found some sick, sick covers of the Mario theme song and stuff like that online. They're, they're all really jazzy. I don't know if you guys like jazz, but I really do. Um, so I hope you guys check those out. Um, they're really, really cool. I really like them. I listened to a couple of them quite a few times today. So, uh, yeah. Check those out and uh, enjoy them. <laughs> Polyworld, eh? Yeah, I'm a little bit sleepy, but uh, I'm doing this just because. I want to kind of doze off to sleep. Uh, doing stuff like this kind of bores me sometimes. I'm not bore, I mean, it just kind of helps me sleep. Just lets me uh, relax and let me do whatever, you know. Um, anyways, we're heading southward to Seafoam Islands, which is home of Articuno. Um, before we go any further after this, actually, we have another place to visit. Um, there's a place south of the rock tunnel we entered, um, and we're gonna go there soon enough, um, and that is the home of Zapdos, um, and we will be visiting that area, so I want you guys to prep for that, I don't want you guys to prep for it, I mean I will, you know, but it's just gonna be really, really difficult to catch, so I'm gonna have to stock up on Ultra Balls and Great Balls and Pokeballs and... Don't ask why Pokeballs, because I've seen some pretty crazy stuff going out with those things. Um, I've actually watched 52 Rock Lee catch um, a Zapdos and a Moltres with a Pokeball. Um, I'm not sure why that is, but I mean, I've seen him do it, and it's astounded me both times, to say the least. Um, I did question reality for quite some time after that, I will not lie to you guys. Um, I wondered if he was hacking life, real life, somehow. Um, 
<laughs> Turns out he wasn't. It's just he was getting really lucky. Um, yeah. So we did double status alignments to him. Um, burn and confuse. I'm surprised this isn't working in our favor a little more. But that's okay. That's fine with us. Tentacool. Err. Tentacool. Flatting my tentacles. Yeah. Um, I remember watching a Pokemon episode <laughs> where there was a giant tentacool that attacked the city. Or Tentacruel, I think it was. And it was really angry, and I'm not sure why, but I remember Ash and Brock and them defeated it, and it was really, really crazy, and I was just like, wow. Can you imagine a Pokemon like that in real life attacking real people? I mean, everybody would be like, oh my god, WTF, flailing arms, OMFG, barbecue sauce. I just threw in the barbecue sauce just because. Um, I might not be posting a video of these for a little while because I want to get Hyper Beam for all my Pokemon. Um, yeah. It's actually a really uh, tedious process to do, so I mean, it'll be a while before I pick them all up. Uh, I usually have it taught to all of my primary Pokemon. So I'm just like, warning you guys right now. Uh, it might be a day or two before I post another one of these videos. I tried dying for Pokemon, but it was a no-go! That's fine. Oh, I... Crud, I forgot to heal Vulpix. Okay, uh, we'll just switch out to Alakazam real quick. That'll be my answer to this. Uh, okay. Or Gyarados. Gyarados will be good. Ah, brah, brah, brah. Ugh, I'm kind of excited to get Articuno. Uh... I know it won't be for a while, but I mean, it'll still be fun. And I have to teach one of my Pokemon strength, too. Crap. Yeah, I should probably get on that soon, but uh, I haven't yet. I don't know why. Uh, Shelter. Another Pokemon that'll confuse me. And make me a very, very angry trainer. Okay, I'm gonna toss it all because I am. Ugh. Withdraw. Ah, sweet. Didn't decide to confuse me in any way. That could be bad if it did. Uh, okay. Seeking. Yeah. See. Queer. I don't know. That was stupid. Sorry, guys. My bad. I fail, I know. That's okay, right? I'm everybody's favorite Pokemon trainer. Wow, uh, Rikudo saying used egocentric. Um, a couple of people will get that, and they'll probably laugh at it. So, uh, hehehe. <laughs> yeah, that was for my friends out there in Konoha Village. I love you guys. Okay, so, uh, gotta bring up Volpix and heal it and all that goodness. Okay. Uh, oh, we're pretty deep into this video. Okay, I'm gonna scoot on this way. Okay, that's fine. Uh, I should start cutting out these Pokemon battles. I know you guys must be getting sick of them. I think we have time for one more battle. There's a group of trainers right there. Uh, yeah. So, I'm not sure we'll be able to get all those in this video. Um, so I'm just gonna pound this one out and maybe in one more and we'll go. Uh, that'll be it for the night. So, uh, yeah. Ah. Sorry, my hands are getting all cramped up and stuff. Not cramped up, just kind of stiff. Um, yeah. Volpix is level 30, 42. Jeez, what the hell's the matter with me? I think I'm gonna have to get rid of Roar. Uh, so now we can make it into uh, Nine Tails or a QB in Japanese. Uh, I just thought you guys should know that. That means Nine Tails. 
Naruto knowledge for the win. Yeah, this battle should be over any second now. Sorry about that. I was just uh, sipping on some tea. By the way, uh, I acquired some Oolang tea recently, and uh, it is really, really good. Um, they sell it in North America, but it's usually at specialty to stores and stuff. So, uh, yeah. If you guys like tea, you guys should try some of that. Um, and we're nearing the end of this video, so... Uh, this is Rikudo Senin signing out, saying, have a good night, have a good morning, whatever. Um, yeah, so rate, comment, subscribe, and peace, love, and respect. I'll see you guys later.